Well, David, luckily they have that cleared up for your morning commute today. The crews did clear out that tractor trailer that was on fire as well as all of the, the debris that was associated with it. Now they got that cleared this morning, but they've been on scene since 11 o'clock last night. They got the call uh, for about and they were again on scene for about seven hours. The Colchester fire chief says uh, that they got the call after a driver saw smoke coming from the back of his truck. He removed the tractor from the trailer, luckily, though, and it was filled with furniture. A third of the truck was covered in flames when crews from Chittenden and Grand Isle counties got to this scene. Now, multiple crews plus a tanker were needed to extinguish the fire. It was full and uh, very compact, so we had great difficulty trying to get the fire out. Um, Use about 21,000 gallons of water to uh, extinguish the fire. Now, even after the fire was out, it took several hours for all of the debris to be cleaned up and again for that truck to be stable enough to be cleared out. And that only happened within the last 30 minutes. The cause of the fire still unknown at this time. Injuries, none to report, luckily. Uh, but again, at least this uh, accident has been cleared. Uh, the fire has been cleared uh, this morning for your morning commute. Uh, and you can see all that's left are the cones behind me, but cars are rolling through there. So you are all good to go. We are live in Colchester this morning. Jackie Pascal, NBC5 News.